from the Knoxville Visitor Center in downtown Knoxville, Tennessee. It's Tennessee Shines! <laughs> The Tomato Head Restaurant, Crown Plaza, Knoxville, Little River Trading Company, and listeners like you. Good evening, everybody. I'm Paige Travis, and we're so glad to have you here at the Knoxville Visitor Center, listening on WDVX FM and streaming worldwide on WDVX.com. We're here Monday nights at 7 o'clock. How about a warm welcome to my co-host, and one man house band, Bob Deck. Thanks so very much. Tonight's musical guests officially call Cincinnati home. But they've spent so much time on the road lately, their van might earn those honors. While you're tapping your toes to their old time sounds, listen for the influence of Woody Guthrie, John Hartford, and maybe Maybe just a smidgen of the pogues. Please welcome to Tennessee Shines, the Tillers! Yes. 
history from about the 20s and 30s that Mike wrote. This one's about a road that goes all the way across the country called There is a Road Route 50. got strings, this guy will play it. His name's Michael Oberst. Yeah. 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 guitar, and vocal, dobro, banjo, mandolin, and again, if it's got strings, he'll, he'll wrestle with it. Sean Guile. Yeah. Holding down the bottom, Aaron Guile. Yeah. He's also doing, doing vocals and guitar and a lot of everything. Uh, Mike and Sean, you're closest to the mic there. So let me, I'm going to address, uh, address most of this to you guys. Aaron, if you want to step up there, feel free. Uh, your most recent record? It's called Hand on the Plow. Is that correct? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Hand on the Plow. What's, uh, what's, is there, what's different about it? What's your favorite thing about it? Well, Hand on the Plow, how many albums do we have right now? Four? Okay. So <laughs> that now, now that we've established that, and I've remembered that. Um, this is the this is the one that um, this is our first completely original uh, album. Every song on this on this album 
is 100% uh, original. Well, uh, okay, probably not 100%, you know, there are a little, uh, little elements in the new album where we're definitely drawing from old traditional songs, and sometimes we put those songs, little riffs of those songs into, into our created songs, so um, you'll hear some brand new stuff from us, and then a couple of really old things from, from the history books. So of music. <laughs> most of, but, but, and, and most of tonight's selections will be from that, uh, from that record, is that right? Uh, yes, no? Tonight's uh, yeah, most of the songs we're going to play today comprise. will be from that. Yeah. Excellent. You guys, are on the, you guys are constantly on the road. I, we alluded to that at the, at the top of the show. I'm curious, what do you, what do you listen to while you're, while you're driving from gig to gig? Well, it's very, it changes quite drastically, I would say. We're fans of all sorts of music. What were we listening to today? Dead Milk Man. The Dead Milk Man, man today. Um, yesterday we were listening to some classical talk radio. Yeah. Um, podcasts man. were big with yeah, a lot podcast. of bands. I asked this of a lot of bands, and they said, oh yeah, well, you know. Uh, Wu-Tang Clan. There you go. <laughs> So the month might be funny. <laughs> who wouldn't? Yeah. Who wouldn't want to do that? It's, you know, sometimes if we're going through New York City, yeah, very absolutely. Well, would be the Wu Tang Clan, but you know, sometimes when we're heading through Virginia, it might be the Carter Ooh, family. There you go. Or you know. Oh West, well, that's what I'm but, curious. Do you play stuff that would be maybe appropriate for that region, for that stretch of road? I don't at know. times. Yeah. At times. Yeah. Uh, then this is this is something else. Tell me a little bit about this very cool thing that you're doing for a friend back home in Cincinnati. Uh, Lauren Hill, uh, you are donating 50% of all your merchandise sales for the month of November to this organization called Tour for a Cure. Tell yeah. us a little bit about that. It, well, the organization's called A Cure Starts Now, oh, okay. and their, their, uh, you know, their efforts are in trying to find a cure for uh, a type of cancer called DIPG, pediatric brain cancer. And uh, that's what Lauren Hill has. She's a little bit older. Um, it mostly affects young kids. She's 19. And uh, you might have heard about her recently. She's a basketball player for the Mount St. Joseph. But she's a pretty special person. And, uh, and she just has uh, such a positive attitude about things. And she's going to uh, do everything she can for as long as she can to help these younger kids and to try to find a cure for the IPG. And she just really is an inspirational person, and um, especially to us. Yeah. Well, we wish her the very best, and mm -hmm. uh, we, our hearts go out to her and her family. Yeah. Uh, thank you guys for the efforts uh, on her behalf. Thank you. So. Right now, more songs from The Tillers on Tennessee Shine. 